Dahil nga po may mga nagtatanong ng aking mga sikretong malong pere. Hindi pwede pa bulo kong mamapamula ka ng malutong, makinis, maputi siya. Ba't ganon? Ang dami siya nang nangyong tong tong tong. Grabe, grabe. Gusto pa rin kita. Bakit ko ba nga ba nga nang patang yun? So, credit sa mga klase ko dyan. Hi, Max. Hey, Shell. Dahil sa inyo ito eh. guys, it's me Jay and I am back with another video. So in this video, I'll be showing you guys how I edit my Instagram photos dahil may mga nagtatanong kung paano ko ina-edit yung Instagram photos ko yung feed ko, kung anong filter yung gamit ko. Pero guys, walang filter yun. Promise, wala talaga akong ginagamit ng filter. Puro adjustments lang sa... Adjustments? So, puro, ad oh, puro adjustment lang yun sa VSEO cam yung ginagawa ko. So if you wanna know how I edit my Instagram photos or yung feed ko, just keep on watching. So let's start this tutorial. So before anything else, chine-check ko muna kung ano yung last na in-upload ko sa Instagram. So as you can see, more on pink, blue, and something dark green yung feed ko. Then after ko makita kung ano yung last na in-upload ko, titignan ko kung yung ano yung mga na-collect kong pictures. Then after that, We'll go to the VSEO cam. So, yung VSEO cam lang yung ginagamit kong editor para sa Instagram feed ko. Then, pipili na tayo kung ano yung mga i-upload natin. So, ito yung pinaka-ayaw kong part kasi sobrang tagal mag-import ng mga photos. Finally, na-import na lahat ng photos. So, let's proceed to the first one. So, as you can see, medyo blurry siya. So, may mga filters dito sa VSEO cam. Pero, hindi ako gamagamit ng mga filters. So, let's proceed to the first tool, which is yung sharpen. So, isa-sharpen natin siya para mas maging detailed yung photo. Then, yung exposure. After that is yung contrast. So, ginagamit ko yung contrast para mas ma-highlight yung kulay ng isang photo. The next one is yung tint. Para ma-highlight yung pink na part or magkaroon ng pinkish tone. So, let's proceed to the next photo. So, ganun lang din. I-adjust ko yung contrast. Yung bright. Kasi lower down natin siya kasi masyadong after that we'll go to the sharpen tool para mas maging detail dagayin yung photo then last one is yung tint pa so let's proceed to the next photo so kung mapapansin nyo guys iba iba yung pagkaka adjust ko ng exposure and contrast so here the lower down kay exposure para mas makita yung sunset and after that yung contrast para mabuhay yung kulay then yung tint so here's the result and then the next photo is this one so dadagdagan ko lang onti yung contrast kasi medyo patay yung kulay then ilalower down ko ng powerful yung exposure para mas ma-highlight yung kulay red. Then after that is yung sharpen para mas maging detail pa. And then of course the last one is yung tint. Kung mapapansin nyo guys, iba-iba yung level or intensity ng mga tools na ginagamit ko. Yung paggamit nun is nakadepende sa quality ng photo. So in this photo, tataasin natin yung contrast para mabuhay yung kulay ng photo then yung exposure para medyo maging pastel sya then the next one is yung sharpen para mas maging detail yung photo
Then after that is yung tint para magkaroon ng pinkish tone. So yeah, let's proceed to the last photo. So in this photo, I want to highlight the rainbow color. So ilalower down ko yung exposure and tataasan ko yung contrast para mas ma-highlight yung rainbow na color. Again, gagamitin natin yung sharpen para mas maging detail pa yung photo. And then after that, is yung tint para magkaroon ng pinkish tone yung photo. And finally, ito na yung favorite part ko. Mag-upload ng photo. Ito naman yung pinakamahirap na part kasi sobrang hirap mag-isip ng caption. Just a simple advice guys, kung wala kayong makaption, just emoji, but make sure that your emoji is related to your photo. So before ako mag-upload sa Instagram, I'm using some hashtags para mas marami pang makakita ng i-upload ko. And yes, finally uploaded na. So that's it guys, ganun lang ako simple mag-edit ng picture sa Instagram kasi ayoko na sobrang daming ginagamit na app kasi the more na mas madami kang app na ginagamit, parang pumapangit na yung quality ng pictures mo. Kaya pangit din naman pag mag-upload ka, diba? Yung pangit ng grainy na yung picture. So ayoko nang ganun. And aside from that, gusto ko kasi parang natural lang yung mga ano, picture na ina-upload ko. Parang ayan, ganyan na siya, onting ano lang, upgrade, upgrade lang, lightness, darkness, mga ganun lang yung ginagawa ko. And I hope you enjoyed watching this video guys and if you did give this video a big thumbs up comment down below kung gusto niyo pa ng tutorial kung paano magplatay ganyan ganyan kung and i-comment niyo din kung gagawin niyo ba or ginawa niyo na yung kung paano ako mag-edit kung parehas oh tapos ta basta <laughs> ang hirap naman basta gets niyo na yun eh basta gin pag ginawa niyo yung oh yes do you mean Basta kung gagayahin nyo tong tutorial na to, just comment down below and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos like this and please click also the bell button beside the subscribe button down here for you guys to be notified whenever I upload a new video. Always be different and be yourself. And we'll see you guys on my next video.